Right now, a three-year-old child is in critical condition after being found in a pool at a home in Southwest Miami-Dade. Neighbors tell NBC6 the property is an Airbnb. NBC6 reporter Steve Litz is live from that home. He talked to a woman whose husband performed CPR on the little girl. Steve. Boy, and traumatic for that woman. You're going to hear from her in a minute, Juwan. And we do understand this little girl is three years old, fighting for her life. A whole lot of prayers bring, being said for her at this hour. That building right by, behind me there, that's the portion of the house, which is the pool, and it's covered with a screen. Uh, witnesses say that when this girl was pulled from the pool, she was in her pajamas. A three-year-old girl pulled lifeless from this pool. Children's floaties and pool safety gear on the deck. It was like very traumatic. Melissa Hayes is now coping with seeing the near drowning of the little girl. She and others are wondering how did the three year old fall in, needing CPR to be revived? She heard screams coming from the house, saw the commotion, then called her husband over. He tried to resuscitate the girl. He got there and she was, wasn't moving. To, and uh, so he knew, you know, to tell them what they were panicking, obviously, like any anybody would. And he was telling them, you know, get it to turn her over and they were trying he could hear there was you know something going on but they were they couldn't get her her pulse back you know her breathing it happened about 1 30 at the indoor pool at this home it's right near southwest 184th street and us1 in cutler bay neighbors say it's an airbnb with people and families coming and going Miami-Dade police arrived quickly, and so did medics who rushed the girl to a nearby hospital. The response was very quick, and um, we've been praying for, for her. Hayes and others are hoping the girl recovers. Police spent hours here looking for an answer as to how a three-year-old girl slipped out of an adult's sight and ended up in a pool. We do know that a woman and a child is inside, and presumably there were some other adults inside as well. But again, investigators are trying to figure out how this child slipped out of the supervision of an adult and ended up in that pool. We'll keep you posted. Live in Cutler Bay tonight, I'm Steve Litz, NBC6 News.